I am Sister Gracie Rodriguez, and this is my story. Goa is a beautiful place. The nature, the beauty, the different cultures of people. In Goa, many children are kidnapped, put in the profession of beggary, child labor. We sisters are involved in empowering the children. Education plays an important role in the lives of our children. Good morning, students. Good morning, sister. By educating them, we help them to be safe from illicit trafficking of children. This is all uh, people who are migrated from different parts of uh, India. The living condition in slums are very bad. The people are very, very poor. The water, the sanitation is also bad. So we work for their empowerment. We also train the women so that they earn at small scale their own livelihood. The women now have confidence to take this forward to sustain their lives. I have been in Goa for five years and I see the situation, drug abuse, murder, rape and Goa being the destination state for sex trafficking is becoming worse and worse day by day. But there is a hope. I see a light that gives life to the humanity. Through our network, collaboration with the police and our supportive systems, the beacon of hope can be brought in the lives of the victims of human trafficking. That whatever the cases has come, we did got justice for the victims of human trafficking. I cannot do it alone. I am just a drop in the ocean. So I need others' support, others' collaboration. And my first and immediate supporters are my sisters. And above all, it is God to bring hope, love and mercy to the people. Here in my convent, we share our works, our mission. We participate in each other's joys and sorrows. So it is very important for all the religious, for all of us, that we collaborate in every field, in every ministry which we are involved with. So together as a community, we are working together and we respond to the call which God has given us.